clear, calm night. You couldn't ask for a better place. We were about to see a storm, I believe. No disqualifications here, so that's good to see. Race 29, men's A race. Monument Mile. Here we go. And we are off. So Alistair Hay is our pacer here. And he is targeted to take us around at a sub four pacing. So he is off. And he is flying. Ben McMillan of Central AC and Stirling University is tracking him closely. He and told he me he was going to sit right behind that pacer, get to that KA in, in sub 230, and then bring it home. And I he's mean, gonna Ben McMillan's in incredible form. 13.51 last week for 5k, so incredibly versatile as well. So we might see that strength needed to, to take the win tonight, that's but it's an incredible fast start. That's perfect through 200 from Ali here. You wouldn't expect any less. Sub four. Mr. Consistent consistently hits the times again. Ben McMillan, the local favourite. Being a member of Central for 10 plus years, but wearing the university. He wants that 250 pound he wants, voucher. Yeah, he wants them both. Both Here for 250. Here goes Ali Hay coming down the home straight with Ben McMillan closely following. Then we've got Michael Ferguson in there. Jack Pan in behind Michael Ferguson. Then we've got Ben Sandilands, ben Andrew Sand Milligan, Kieran Riley. What a stack. Yeah. I think that's I James Donald and Johnny Glenn off the back there slightly. I could um, list every name and it'd be stacked. I believe Johnny Glenn's training for marathons at the moment. Probably got his eyes on that Commonwealth Games spot. So yeah. uh, this might be a little bit quick for him at the moment. But he's still going well at the moment. Didn't see what the split was at 400. Sorry, folks. So 58, 58 to 400. So bang on Great for a sub-4 mile. Are we going to see a sub-4 again at the Monument Mile Classic? We didn't have one last year. Two years ago, we did. We could be seeing one tonight. And I, I am... <laughs> Incredibly excited as an athletics fan. Feel nervous. I'm nervous for the boys. Ali Hay still leading this one out, doing an incredible job of pacing this one. We're coming up to the 800 meter mark, and I think he is bang on pace. But as you said, would you expect anything less from Andy McMillan? So here comes Ben McMillan. Ben McMillan. Perfect. From Michael Ferguson. And we've got Jack Patton in there, number two. 159 through 800. So they are starting to break away slightly. They are tracking the pacer, who's doing a fantastic job. But still, Ben McMillan right in behind, and he is making a move. Ben he's, McMillan he's is telling Ali he needs to get the move on. Shoulder, and he said, you better move out of the way, because I'm coming past. Michael Ferguson still, still sitting tracking. in behind. Then there's Jack. That's Kieran Riley. Kieran, Kieran Riley's moved. just made a move. He's watched that green in, move in away. That green, and he, in that green of Stirling University. A 3.42.1500 meter runner. He is not letting that group a go. A very experienced runner is Kieran Riley. He's a smart racer. He was fifth at box. So we have Ben McMillan. Ben McMillan coming up to 500 metres to go. And I think we're still bang on pace. We're on back 245 at 500 we're to go. We're bang on pace for a sub four. Are we going to see one at the University of Stirling track again? Here goes Ben. Ben McMillan of Stirling University. He's coming to take the bend. We are going through in three minutes. We might see a sub four mile here. Ben McMillan, the local favourite. Jack Patton is stuck in behind. And then Michael Ferguson's there, but Kieran Riley's coming. Sterling University is Kieran Riley. Are we, are we going to see a one-two from Sterling University? Kieran Riley is moving, but Jack Patton is in his way. Ben McMillan is striding away from the field here. It's an incredible run from Ben McMillan, but it's never over in a mile. Kieran Riley's making a move. Kieran Riley, the other Sterling University man, he is tracking Ben. Who's going to take this one? Ben McMillan, incredible running from the young Sterling man. Are we going to see a sub four mile from Benjamin McMillan? He's coming down. I think we're going to see a sub four mile here, guys. We're this 3 is going to be a sub now. four mile from Benjamin now. McMillan. An incredible run from the young man. He is making history tonight in Sterling. He's done it. 3.57. 357 mile from Benjamin McMillan. An absolutely incredible run. And I, for one, am 